ladies and gentlemen welcome again to channel 48 after some days of resting my bones i'm back because yeah i was as well working on a port for the 280 the tablet a6, a6 from samsung and i made a port a e foundation port for the device but more about that device uh, later in some next video this video is about the S9 again. But you just showed the S9. Yes, I know, but hey, what do you see here? What logo you see here? Lineage OS. So, I was scrolling the list at Lineage OS and looking at the development these last two days. And I discovered that we have official Lineage OS 20 now for the S9, the Note 9 and the S9 Plus. But not only that, as well Android 13 for the S5 family, the KLTE and all these other models by Calvat. So ladies and gentlemen, can I have an amazing applause for these two developments? Thank you. That one was for Lineage OS, but as well for Badar, because Badar is the maintainer and I'm very proud to see Badar's name there. You know, I mean like, we all know Badar from the past. I showed many ROMs from Badar. I cannot even remember which one anymore, but many in the past. Because when I saw the name Badar, I was immediately like, hey, this is brother Badar. Here you can see a picture of him. I hope it's the right picture. <laughs> if not, I'm terribly sorry. But I, yeah, Android developer, LinkedIn, you know. I mean, like this looks like a Badar to me. So I think this is the Badar. So thank you so much, Badar, for bringing that to, um, to the S9. It's beautiful. So I as well want to install it. <laughs> Maybe we can fix the, the fender. Remember the red lines that you saw in the previous video? So I'm grabbing my S9 again. I must say that I really, I really enjoyed uh, the previous room. And uh, yeah, I was like, Shall I make a video about it again? But I, I thought, yes, I should. Because how can I not talk about it? I mean, like, the Pine was the first to reach official Lineage OS 20 not so long ago. I made a video about it. And, uh, yeah, when I saw that the S9 got official development by Lineage OS, I was like, hey, <laughs> no, 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 no. I cannot just uh, yeah, let this pass me by. I must make a video. But I must tell you that uh, the Android 13 that we installed in the previous video, yeah, the uh, Pixel Experience by Dylan, it works really nice. And uh, the AI as well works good. You know, the thing, you can talk to it, you can, you know, you get, you get the right um, files from the gaps that is already pre-built in. Voices, speech recognition, everything works good. So, yeah, I'm not deleting the Pixel experience because it's not good. So, I mean, like, you don't have to all go wipe your Pixel experience and, and, and start installing uh, Lineage OS 19 or 20. But uh, for this video, I'm going to do it because I'm very proud to see that Lineage OS 20 came to the S uh, to the S9. So um, let me not talk any longer. Let me put you on the tripod and let's go ahead and install it together and see if we can fix these crazy red lines. <laughs> I think now is the time to go and look on marketplaces if you have some some phone that yeah that needs a higher build of Android, but it's not supported. Its name is Huawei or anything else like that. Then look on marketplaces if you can find a secondhand S9. 
okay but not any s9 you must look it must be the g960 f or the g965 f or the n960 that's the note not the others eh? because not snapdragon you must look good before you buy don't buy s9 snapdragon because otherwise we can as well not help you this is only exynos okay don't tell the guy that you're gonna put Linux OS on it. Otherwise the price will go up. Just tell it you need it for parts. <laughs> I'm teaching you to do business, huh? Don't be too enthusiast. When, when you know, look for one that they sell for maybe with a little cracks or if you want a good looking one like this one. This one has a little crack as well, but you don't see it. No, there's no crack, or does it? I don't even know. I think here, yeah, here we have a little crack. You see that? I need to put a nice uh, thing on top of it. But okay, um, so the right procedure to install the ROM. Yeah, we format the data, we reboot it back into recovery. We first install Lineage OS. Some of my breakfast jumped onto this thing. Nice phone, very nice phone. The S9 is a very, very lovely phone. Eh? It's a very good phone. And the S5 too. So we as well gonna take a look at the S5. You see patching fender image. That's why we don't get red light red line anymore. Fender fill uh, etc. filled. Then that show has fixed it. <laughs> so uh, what we're gonna do now is uh, install it. Don't reboot, eh? Don't reboot now. Install Nick Gaps Core 64 bit. And there we go with thanks to Nigil Mengani, the proud of the custom room world and we are all proud of him making these nice gaps packages for us mm -hmm. there we go what is it saying fail to oh no, nothing it did say nothing and they say nothing nothing it did not say nothing it says successfully installed, Mr. Darlington. Lineage. <laughs> you wanted to scare me, huh? Don't you do that to me, huh? <laughs> mm -mm 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 -mm. This is super deluxe. Hey, I'm not charging. Hold on. There we are, peeps. There we are. Welcome to Lineage OS. Welcome to your S9. That just got a new live official, okay? And, you know, when you have an official development, I would leave this one on, eh? Oh, the thing is on, on, on Dutch. Yeah, we're gonna just overslaan. Oh wait, why why overslaan? No. Oh, but the, the fingerprint is at the back. Um, so this thing has fingerprint. I never use that, you know. Shall we shall we see if it works? No, I must put code. I hate codes. I don't like codes. Hey, listen, we're gonna we're gonna soon see, okay? We're just gonna skip for now. And then we go in. All right, you see that? All right, so the Play Store is installed, ladies and gentlemen. Humans of this earth. Creations of God. Mm? All humans. Look at that. 
we have it installed. Is that not beautiful? So this is how your S9 can start its new life on the 24th of April 2023. Samsung has let them go. And thanks to Badar and LineageOS, the phone is back as a brand new second hand. So I think that um, the second hand market for this phone will be uh, very uh, active soon. At least you guys that see these kinds of videos and know the value of what you can bring to your to your yeah, device. This can as well be your new device. Uh, there are many S9s uh, that thanks to the news of the leak, uh, people don't want to have these phones anymore because of the Exynos chip that has a, a problem, okay? In all these phones, that's the case, uh, but only on uh, yeah, custom ROMs, yeah, we don't have this problem anymore, okay? Because Volte and these things, yeah, they don't work. This are proprietary from Samsung, and yeah, that just doesn't work. Internet, SIM card, uh, Leica Mobile, VPN, hotspot. You see that there is no Wi-Fi calling or so. Let me uh, connect really fast to the internet. By the way, look at this beautiful keyboard. It feels so nice to just use it. And the only thing that is missing from it are the clicks. Okay, and there we go. We are connected. This thing feels so, so stable, so, so, so amazing. It feels so, so new. So, yeah. This is just amazing, amazing engine running on it at this moment. As well with the fender and so. Really, really sweet. So um, the camera, the camera works. I can tell you that it works. Oh, look at the nice wallpaper here. Nice. The flash was on. Flash off. No. Flash was on, on again. How do we turn it off? Like this. Nice. Lovely wallpaper. And the Air telling how to put this wallpaper. I don't know, I will see later. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Oh, nice. Themed icons. Hey, I didn't know that. Wow. Sweet. Apple styled. Nice. Oh, <laughs> look at that. I want that wallpaper. Hold on. Um, achtergrond. No, my own. Toestaan. This one. This one. Yes. Boat. I like that yellow. Oh, now it changed. Now it's pink. These icons are not changing. Okay. So only the, yeah, it's nice, but these icons will fluke a little bit. So, um, yeah, 
different color yeah this is nice i i i this is nice let me see oh yeah but then i don't want to see these icons for either so nice phone works tut, 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 tut. sounds really sweet I like the dark green, eh? it looks so nice with the red icon. Oh, like a mobile, I love you. You know that, huh? Eh? Oh, it's self calling. Now, where's my call? Hello? Sluiter. You did not press any key. Oh, here it is. nice sweet it works man look at that peeps nice phone lovely phone so um things like um, security let's take a look at security find my device it's turned on so this thing is administrator status uh, fingerprint pin code one two three four next one two three four yes more 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 okay and then here at the back Look at that, it works, man. Look at that, peeps. Only I think the place is a little bit ridiculous at the back. But I think if you are not using a cover that you should use, okay, even if you buy this thing secondhand, remember that this was a phone from 1,000 euros and not because you get it for 75 or for 100 or maybe even cheaper or completely free you should use it or treat it as if it's a piece of trash okay don't do that this is a high quality very nice device yeah many phones in the store that you see there can only dream of being this what you see in front of you with the hardware that this thing has and comes with the dignity, the power, look and feels just for the fingerprint. I think it's ridiculous that it's at the back, but okay. That's just how it is. But uh, yeah, a nice phone with a great camera. You can go ahead and film your band with this, with this phone. And uh, you will come home with a nice video and a nice sounding music quality so not with not like with the s5 and the s6 so this is a nice phone that will not lose value in the coming years listen to my words what i'm saying for the coming years if you have a good battery in this thing yeah you treat it nicely you don't compare your phone with your friend's phone that are on the newest and I don't know phones from I don't know how much. You can be proud having this S9, this powerful S9 that will let you do all sorts of things if you don't have too much uh, wishes. But I think even those with wishes playing games and so and etc on this phone will have a great time enjoying Lineage OS 20 on the Samsung Galaxy S9. The next development that we're going to take a look at is the Android 13 for the Samsung Galaxy S5, the KLTE. And I have one here in my hand 
and this phone I got with thanks to Hayan. I always say it because yeah, he's my marketplace friend and he gave me the phone completely free after I complimented him selling uh, S5 Mini with Lineage OS. I saw that, <clears throat> so I sent him a message. I said, hey, so nice that you're, you know, selling the phone with Lineage OS. Great, great job. And uh, we started talking and I said I was looking for uh, S5 KLTE model because mine died, the one from my mom, remember? And he said he has one, but it has a burnt-in screen. And if I want, I can come and pick it up. So nice. It was at the beginning of Corona time. So of course I went and picked it up and so, and yeah, made many videos and as well ROMs for it and tested as well the Android 13 by Calvat. So we're gonna see how it is. Calvat has a source for page now. So um, yeah, that's, that's amazing. All the phones are supported and I saw that we have a development for, um, for, for April 2023. So yeah, it must be in the show. So let's go ahead and install it. S5 uh, KLTE, the G900F, is a nice phone. <laughs> Some people think that it's not a nice phone, but I can tell you our Dutch police uh, used these phones and running on the yeah, fully caps package that they came with these phones. Of course, battery was always a problem and sometimes they had to use their own phones and then would get disciplined by the commander. They are not allowed to do that. But then again, if they must solve a case and their, you know, <laughs> battery is empty, then there is nothing else better to do than use another phone, right? So this phone has a complete history. It's not a bad phone, only battery, you know? and things can or sometimes improve thanks to and here you can see it this build was released on the 18th of april 2023 oh you cannot read it oh man man what is wrong with you phone there you go lineage was 20. you see that so let's see if the boot up issue was fixed okay and there we go we're installing android 13 on the <coughs> samsung galaxy why is my screen so so fussy hey what is that man sorry for that peeps i'm back okay so we're flashing android 13 onto a phone that ended up with Android 6, 601 it was. And after that, nothing happened. Then we got Lineage OS 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and now we reach 20. These are many generations, so you can never say that this is yeah okay it's not maybe it's maybe not the most uh, modern phone in the world to see but if you give it a nice little uh cover are we done flashing or did i did i did i stop the complete flashing i don't know something happened can you while you flash let's do the flashing one more time I don't know if I did it good. Can you hit backspace? No, I think it was it was done. I thought I hit it back and then the install quitted. So now we're doing a double install. Uh, install on top of its own. That should not hurt. But this is amazing. Look at all these generations. 
that this phone went through. Only the S4 did not come to 13 yet. And even 12. Or do we have 12? Lineage was 19. No, 18. Official. I don't know if JTC brought it to 12. I think I think they did. They did not bring it to 13 yet. We have 19 by JTC. Okay. So, um, shall we as well install gaps immediately? Let's do that. So we can give you a complete package. Downloads. And it was Nick. Nick Caps 13. Let's immediately install it. Because I'm not sure if this install will be encrypted. Nick Caps Core 13. There we go. So this old phone will be on the Google ecosystem where you can go ahead and connect to your accounts and there we go and there's a very long boot delay don't worry about it that's just the way it is That's just the way it is. Things will never be the same. That's just the way it is. Oh yeah. I see no changes. Hey. Que vaza. It's so you much. Oh my goodness. I see no changes. All I see is nonsense. Okay, wait. Let me connect it to the charger. This thing is a little bit loco. Let's press volume down, home, and power. Turn off. Download mode. There we go. Cancel, volume down, restart. Boot delay is kind of long on this device. You need a good battery eh, to run Android 13. There we go. And if we don't reach within three minutes or so, then we're gonna, we're gonna reboot the device. Because then the boot loop was not fixed yet. Okay. So it's important to know that if you're gonna boot Android 13 on the S5 and it's just booting for a long time and nothing happens, to then turn off the phone, kick out the battery or no, we arrived, we arrived, we arrived, I saw the lights going on, there we go, so that was fixed, amazing Calvat, well done, Con congratulations, amazing, so um, there we go, Android 13 is as well available for your KLTE S5, 
update. No, no, no. Yes, improve. And then uh, fingerprint next. Fingerprint. No, 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 no. Password. Ora, ora. Pin. Ocho lali, ocho lali, karo aku mu elingo, mu elingo. Hey, what happened to my fingerprint? At your fingerprint. No, fingerprint is not working. But it doesn't have to. Look at that, peeps. Look at that. Installed. Can you make a picture? You can. Selfie. Oh, the selfie is blocked. Video. You can make a video. It works. Phone. I mean, is found. So that means the phone works. Wi-Fi works. And we are connected. Here we can connect to the Play Store. See that? All in all, a ROM that I can see was fixed in many ways. It feels very smooth. I mean, like, smooth enough for the S5 on Android 13. Honestly, more than smooth for the S5 from uh, what year? Can't remember. But a very old phone that was as well a flagship. And because of its being such an amazing flagship, it can still stand beside its big brother, the S9, or his younger brother. This is the big brother, yeah? 
This is the big brother and this is the younger brother. But as you can see, big brother and young brother, they still stand like champions in 2023. And that, uh, and, and that with thanks, of course, to Lineage OS, but not to forget the developer that took his time to make this and to put this up. So as well support him. If you see a support button, donation. If you love your S5, leave something, but that as well for Lineage OS. Yeah, you can as well donate them. So go ahead and do that. And uh, yeah, let this community be, the, be here for a very long time still, okay? And let's give them the love and then not a broken heart. <laughs> but some real yeah love so they can oh this beautiful picture hold on so this is it peeps um back to the studio android 13 for the s5 and 13 for the s9 and for many other devices that you will see after you subscribe to the channel and left this video a thumbs up then yeah you will find out that here on this channel you might find the unexpected uh yeah for your device eh? a solution to still do something with it or whatsoever yeah all devices are little computers and there's always something that you can do with it always no matter how old well that was it peeps i want to thank you for watching uh Badar and Kalfat, thank you for your work on these devices. Uh, of course, Lineage OS, big up. And then, yeah, watchers, friends of the world, world people, human beings, creatures of God. I say God bless you. And uh, yeah, you'll be seeing me in the next video again. Until then.